ladies and gentlemen. Mm. Uh, before we start today's episode, yeah. Um, yeah. Username xx underscore Sora underscore Sephiroth underscore xx. Uh huh. Your car is being towed um, by uh, us because we're the cops. Yeah. So please, we're letting you know right now that your car is in the impound. So sorry about that. Oh, dude, the jail. Uh, today's episode is featuring Wallace next to me on the mic. I'm holding him today. He just needed to, he just. Uh, whoa, <laughs> is that good? That's a good sound. That's a good Wallace sound. It's a good snore, Dom. Um. I just go straight out this door, don't I? Yeah, uh, a Twitter user told me, fun fact, that gold door handles means that are places go. you can go into. Yeah, that you can go. All right. Why do we so, have this shitty car? It's tight. Where's the fire truck? I actually at? really like it because it's I easy the to. the house fire. I like it because it's easy to. Uh, Drive. It's the best. It's the best car that, I, that 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 we've had, for sure. Is it though? Yes. Is it? I like though? Roy's car better though because it was a convertible. <laughs> I liked Roy's car better because it was a convertible, but that's it. Are we having a conversation, Vic? Okay, fuck it. Forget I. Come I'm on. Teasing you, Hirsch. Tell me about it. Well, the new housing development is a couple of weeks from completion. Burned to the ground last night. GIs are ready to move in this weekend. What? The developer's gonna have some very angry customers. That's the same thing that the Should morphine was gonna pay. Yeah. The arson desk has been trying to nail that son of a bitch for years. He's still in custody, Herschel. Wanna bet? Well, it kicked the moose already. Can't hold him for misdemeanor cigarettes and matches. Huh. You think that guy's the arson? Which one? A guy we caught outside the f scene who like was an arson, but like was like, I don't have anything to do with this. I believe I believe <clears throat> I believe it. He felt too, uh, too, like conveniently there. Yeah. Why the fuck did like, he I run? I don't want any trouble, officers. I didn't mean to be here. It's why like, did he run? You know what here. I mean? When you see a cop, do you run? No. Like I... If I see a cop, I go, this cop can change my life. Like, if I was robbing a house, I might run from the cops. Like, if I was in the process of killing someone, I might run away from the cops. But, you know, if I'm just a dude who's chilling, who didn't do a crime, I don't think I would take off from the cops. Right. What do we got? I can't tell if Wallace is, is good or if he's suffering right now. He's shivering. That's the whole story of Wallace in general. He shivers? Uh, he shivers because he's cold because he got a haircut. Oh, okay. So he's a cold boy. Yeah. I mean, you can give him a blankie if you want. Do you have a blankie, Frazier? There you go. Let's give him a little blankie oh, boy. boy. Look at you. Look at you. <laughs> <laughs> Frazier, take a photo of him. Frazier just tucked this boy in. Take a photo of him. This is amazing. It's going in the... Whoa! Put, Chris, put this photo in the video. I feel like a father. <laughs> <laughs> New baby. <laughs> in the hospital. <laughs> Let me see the photo, Frazier. <laughs> <laughs> take, take another one. One more. Suburban Redevelopment Fund. What the fuck? Just wanna... What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Wait, no, Alex, get in this photo. Get in the photo? Get in the photo. This is, right. this is our friendly right. portrait. Right. This is our Christmas card for, like, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's see. <laughs> Amazing. Chris, show this photo. Yeah, <laughs> great. Great. All right. Let's uh, <laughs> investigate this fucking fire. Holy shit. Mal, my man. Yeah, Frazier, text, text him that photo with no context. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I don't want to watch them. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, no. Morelli, Mike, we recovered a picture of the family. Okay. Anything else? To be honest, I just got here, Phelps. Best you talk to Lynch. He's the expert. Doesn't make any sense. Why aren't they scattered around like the rest of the debris? I think they've been moved. 
Ooh. I think someone moved them after the explosion and before the fire. Can you explain that, please? I'm almost positive the cause of death is asphyxiation due to gas inhalation. Look at the parts of their bodies that aren't scorched. The coloring around the fingertips is typical. They wouldn't have felt a thing. I think the fire damage is post-mortem. I think someone moved him into this room after the explosion. It still doesn't make any sense. Why would you run into a burning building? Holy shit. What the fuck? What the fuck? What are we doing? Prayer effect is from the fire. The muscles and tendons contract. Jesus. Find anything interesting? Go to exhibit B. All right. Fuck. All right. Oh, here's the photo. You ever think about how many people have died in this world? And how big heaven would have to be to accommodate them, Biggs? No, I have not. Show some respect. I was trying to, Biggs. Damn. Just trying to be real, dude. I'm telling you, I think Bill, Biggs' family died. Boy. Yeah, I think so, too. Fires. I think the Sawyer fire went wrong. But what about the guy we have in jail, Phelps? Got the wrong guy. That doesn't explain why he ran into a burning building. What would make anyone do that? Guilt. For the fires? For his mistake. <laughs> this guy wants to burn houses, not families. He expects the houses to be empty. He was trying to redeem himself. Probably thought they'd be happier together. What? You are one very disturbed individual, Phelps. I know you had it rough lately, but you should start to compartmentalize your thoughts. You know what? He could be right. That's how fucking up with an crimes get solved, sure bro. The same guy. Are you telling me that some son of a bitch murdered these people, the whole family, and arranged them here like Cupid dolls? Yes. Might fit, Cole, but I don't think we could ever prove it. There's very little evidence. Oh! Evidence! Yeah. Robert, check out the hot water system. Make sure we're telling you, Biggs, same, like, bro. lost Just his family in the fire. Absolutely. Leave the rest to us, Cole. You better find out what's eating pigs. So I just need to go to Biggs now? Oh, wait, no. Maybe. God. Can you re inspect the victims? I can. Because the head rolled, the body fell over. I don't think I don't think it's doing anything for me Right I'm gonna just get out of this burned This is pretty graphic Yeah Are we out of here? Yeah, I mean, I can walk out the front door, but... Yeah, maybe... Let's go check on... On... Should I go down here? What's going on down here? What is this? What is that? Pliers? Just nothing. I think, I think, it, I don't know if anything's down here, actually. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna need to go get Biggs. Yeah. Cause he's probably sad boy somewhere. Feels bad, man. Stop! Alright. Let's go. What's Biggs' deal? So something finally got to you. You want my help, pretty boy? You got it. You keep riding me, and you won't be pretty much longer. We can get this guy, Herschel. You think you've seen everything, Phelps? I was with the 2nd Marines at Bella Wood. Oh, they got burned. The that went on in that farmhouse. My own guys. That's what happened. Screaming for a way out. We are not going to get this guy. There's going to be no photos and no citations. We're going to kill this guy. End of story. You get this. 
You remember the risks? <sighs> sure. The Morellis were winners too. Their name was on that list. Christ. What the fuck? Look around. What the name is? What they know. I'll go across the street. Okay. I'll try this side. So the last guy was a racist. This guy's a murderer. I haven't done this for years. <laughs> We're just waking. Well, before we go to the neighbors. You don't look like a fire. Yeah, we should go and investigate the heater. Well, right. I just... Alright. Right? Chances are it's an insta-heater. Right. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Exhibit C. Looks like the same model. Fuck! Fucking Varley. Oh, we would have failed if we picked Varley? Yeah. Alright. So I'm gonna just- Yo, stop! <coughs> what is that there? Nothing. Oh. But I'm, I'm still getting clue sound, but does that mean that I just- Newspaper! Oh, here it is. Alright. Let's see what happens. How did you get my number, Ira? At first, I didn't understand you. Ira. And now I do. I'd like you to come back to the clinic. I'm helping other people now, doctor. I think you are confused. What the fuck? Been to the clinic for weeks. I'm not confused anymore, doctor. I'm helping people be together. What? This world is only oh my god, I remember when he was trying to burn shit down earlier. Why don't you tell me where you are and I can come to you? In one of these. I think the fire should end now. They have served their purpose. Oh, the fires are only beginning, Doctor. After the fires, everything will be beautiful and clean. Everything will be erased. The world will be fresh and new. I can see my purpose now, Doctor. Oh, and fuck. You me to find it. We got a problem. Yeah, we do. We got a real big problem. Yeah. We got a big problem. There's a fireman out there. Right. A true fireman. Right. All right. So you think I should go talk to the neighbors? Yeah, I mean, now Now let's now let's go talk to the neighbors. I think I think we just Are you sure there's nothing downstairs? This doesn't make sense to go in the basement. <sighs> I guess it's just like why would they have a basement? What was that? Did you hear that? Can you guys hear him snoring? It's really funny. Well, yeah, Wallace is snoring pretty seriously. All right, let's talk to this guy. LAPD. Can you tell me anything about the fire next door? Terrible luck. Imagine after having won that weekend away. What's your name, sir? Foreman. Dudley Foreman. Oh, all right. Let's just talk to him. Yeah. Did you see or hear anything? That <coughs> we were asleep when we heard the explosion. What? Go back to the... What did he say? He said he was asleep when he heard the explosion. He, he said he was... <laughs> Did you hear or see anything I might have? Look. We were asleep when we heard the explosion. He like interrupted me, and I'm wondering if that's because he saw something and he got paid off. Or, or I think he's, yeah, doubt. Like, he's a liar. Like, well, look look at his face. Like, look, see his face, like, being all... He, who, who sleeps through an explosion? That's what I'm saying. Like, Doubt him. You didn't like Morelli, did you? Some neighbors you get along with, some you don't. Guess they should have sold up. Huh. What do you mean? They're knocking down all these old houses and building a new subdivision for GIs. Morelli was being difficult. Planned demolitions. What do you got for How us? How is everybody so chill with, like, the idea that, like, if you're difficult when they're trying to build houses that you have to, like, fucking, like... Can you leave the investigation or no? Uh, what do you mean? Like, can I get out of this? Yeah. I can't. I, maybe. Why? Why? 
Oh, well, let's just knocking these houses down. Let's just Elysian Fields. You must know them. They're billboards. That Monroe character beaming down at you. We've had an offer for the house. Did the Morellis want to sell? I don't know. I doubt that, man. You would have known. Look at his fucking mean ass face. Oh God. You think he's just? I feel like I need to doubt him. Yeah, of course. Whatever you thought of Morelli, his whole family is dead. They couldn't have all deserved that. I want you to help me here, Foreman. Morelli was pig-headed. God damn it. He built the house himself. He didn't want to sell. Stubborn fool was ruining it for all of us. Promotional travel contest. <sighs> you said the Morellis had won a weekend away. To Catalina Island? Yeah, that's right. First thing I thought after the explosion was, thank goodness they was away. Then I find out they were still in there. Who was running the competition? What? I don't know. Huh. Doesn't seem like he knows. Yeah, I don't think he really gives a shit. I think he's telling the truth. Alright. Alright. You didn't enter yourself? I'd already agreed to sell. The competition was an incentive for those who were still thinking about it. What? Alright. Okay, hold on. Do you notice something? What? It didn't say we were done. Yeah. That's why I think there's still some shit in, in the house. Something. Right? Like, what? There's like nothing else here, right? Like, we got the newspaper. We got this. There's these guys over here we can talk to, maybe. That's the press, probably. Yo, is that fucking... No. Look at that guy. Look at this. That... He's this, wearing like the exact same outfit. And that dude's been in the game quite a few times, actually. The dude with the bow tie. Yeah. He's a famous actor. Yeah, but this guy right here is wearing the same exact outfit as fucking. Yeah. Well, let's look around his. Like. <laughs> this guy's yard? Yeah, maybe there's something here we don't know. I don't know about that. What the fuck? Oh my... What the fuck? Oh, that's from the explosion. What? I guess. It must have bursted from the other side. Alright. It's no. a shovel. I don't know about this. Where the fuck are the clues? You don't think there's anything in the basement? I don't know. This is the first time we interviewed someone that didn't say we were done. Yeah. So we're missing something. Trash can. Hmm. Something in the house? What the fuck am I missing? We got this thing. This goes down. Wait, hold up. Oh, it's just. Check the, uh. Oh, whoa. This is the flashbulb. Check the the other neighbor's house. Forced to expose the foundations. The other side neighbor? Yeah, the left the left neighbor. We checked the right. What about the left? This? There's nothing here. It's just an empty lot. Right? I guess. I mean, I don't know. Where the fuck? Where's this clue? It's better not be another one of those damn times when there's just a glitch. I can look it up if you want. Not yet. God damn it. Where the fuck is it? <sighs> this is so annoying. Stop. Oh my god, turn around. Boots. Oh my god, is that a boot print? It's several boot prints. What the f- Can you- Oh my god. Oh. Someone was keeping watch. What? Looks like they were here for quite a while. Brand looks distinctive. What the fuck? Can you look at the blueprint? Oh, you sure can. If this guy has a fucking size eight foot, I'm driving. It wouldn't make any I'm sense. Driving back to my house. It wouldn't make any sense if he had size eight and a half foot. You're right. I killed that guy. 
So you, you inspected the footprint, right? I did. Now fucking go. Now fucking talk to the dude. Be like, was there somebody in your goddamn yard? Yeah. And there it is. God damn, we were so close. Suspicious activity. Did you see anyone hanging around the Morelli's home prior to the explosion? Nope. Can't say as I was looking out, though. Huh. Truth? I'm torn. It's either half truth or half doubt. He's like moving a little bit more than he did earlier. Yeah, dude, it's a tough oh, song. Oh my god. <clears throat> well, look, I know he was fucking there. Should I just doubt him? I know there was a fucking dude there. Yeah, I say we doubt the man. I don't I don't trust this guy. He's I been I feel like I'm gonna lose points. Tell you what. Yeah. I'll take the hit. This is just, this is just, just on this you. This is on me. This is just like a just I will look, you've done it, I've done it. Fuck it. Fuck, fuck it. it. Fuck Beard it. Doubt him. I'm doubting him. Doubt I'm doubting him. Doubting the boy. Sure, Mr. Foreman. There are signs of someone hanging around. I mean, yeah, we have the yeah, that's what I'm saying. Now that you come to think of it, there was a guy. Kind of tall. Skinny, though. Anything else? Orange lumber jacket, a beat up hat, and no hair. I thought he was the pest exterminator guy who was working around here the last few days. But that guy had hair. Thanks for your time, Mr. Foreman. Sure. Well, we fucking did it. If you're interested, I have one of those competition flyers in the kitchen. I could get it for you. If yes, you get it. Be great. Why the fuck didn't you say that before? Any luck, Cole? A couple of things. What did you Whoa. Think of the piece of paper? The origami. origami. Can I take a look? Sure. Paper crane. There's a legend about them. You fold 1,000 of these and you get a wish. Huh. Unfold that shit. Hey, don't break it. I'm not. I'm unfolding it. It looks like a waybill or a flyer. Huh. Or what? Leland Monroe. For Elysian Fields developments. I'm gonna have to go talk to this guy. Probably, yeah. This guy is so different than he is in Fringe. <laughs> or in Lord of the Rings. Oh. I see you already have one. Different. Oh. When did the flyer arrive in your mailbox? They've been arriving for weeks. This one was in the mailbox when I got home from work yesterday afternoon. Huh. Wow. What the fuck? All right. Okay. That can't be coincidence. I'm going to call my girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude, go for it. I'm not going to miss her, dude. Yeah, dude. I miss you. I miss you. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. I can't believe we almost missed that shit. I need an address for a property. I mean, I guess we didn't really have a choice. Fields developments. What? We, we couldn't have missed that the clue. It wouldn't have let us continued. I guess that's true. Avenue, Jesus. Messages, please. If you have a message, contact Captain McKelty immediately. Why? Thanks. Can you put me through, operator? Of course. Here you are. McKelty! What's up, brother? Commander? on the Morelli farm. We're about to go and visit Elysian Fields Developments. You're about to do what? Leland Monroe? He's a personal friend of the mayor and the chief. Are you out of your mind? I'm warning you, Phelps. What the fuck? Why don't any of these police officers have balls? You have something, you bring it to me. You're hanging by a thread, Phelps. We just solved the case. What are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, we just, like, solved this case. Dude, fuck this guy. Yeah, suck a dick, McKelty. I was trying to be nice. McKelty has warned us off over illusion. Where's baby oil? It makes sense. It's a dead end. No, it's not, brother. We should check out Rancho Escondido. You know the place. <gasps> should we, though? Corner of Fountain and Wilton. Let's go. <sighs> All right. So what do we got? Elysian Fields or Rancho Escondido? What do you think? Let's go to... Let's go to Rancho Escondido. Just for now. Don't yeah. want to make any waves yet. I don't want to get taken off yeah. this case before I need to. Can I steal this car? <laughs> How 
are we gonna look yes. around in this thing for? I'm I'm sorry, Mal. Hey dude, I'm real sorry. Mal, I'm sorry, dude. Alright. Now I'm taking the real hearse. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Oh, 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 oh. You're fine, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine, this you're fine. This you're... Okay. Alright, we're doing it. This car doesn't drive as well as the other car that I had. The fire truck? No, the, uh... No, the fire truck, dude. Let's be real. The fire right, that the was best. the best car. My bad. You could have taken the fire truck, I'm just saying. What? What fire... Oh, oh there was a fire, a fire truck, fire truck. Yeah. Nah, this is better. Nah, man. Beer Bros homework, draw. <laughs> I think, Walsh, do you want to go down, buddy? I think you're uncomfortable. No, he's just trying to bury his face in you, dude. That's, is that what it is? Yeah. He's trying to... He's trying to go deeper. <laughs> he can't go any deeper. He likes you're to... tucked in with a fucking blanket. He's a huge fan of Inception. Sorry, guys. I have to go this way. Question of the day. What dumb stuff does your dog do? Boofy likes to eat everything. Wallace, uh... Just... Sometimes just like barks forever. Yeah, this dog has anxiety. He like sits with me in my room and he'll hear a noise and then for like 25 minutes he'll just be like he'll start like by barking and then he'll just like slowly just get to the point where he's just like woof. <laughs> woof. Woo. It's just the woo. two of us that can hear it. <laughs> woof. <laughs> woof. <laughs> woo. Oh. Oh. I never touch the ground. Doesn't count as a, as a crash. Unless it cuts to my funeral. <laughs> <laughs> Smash cut to just Phelps dead. There are times when you really miss a nightstick. There's more religion in the end of a nightstick than in a hundred cathedrals. All right, calm down. Come on, those are our houses! I'm not gonna tell you again, sir. Don't tell me when and how I can come and go on my own property. It is not. This is America, safe, dickhead. Sir. Now step back, or I'll lock you up for Smart a fight. Son of a bitch! Did you just punch oh, a cop. Oh shit! Come on, there. go in there. Oh my Punch god. Punch random dudes. How do I how do I fight? How do I fight? <laughs> None of the buttons are working. How do I fight? Oh, there we go. Okay. Gotcha. Let's go. Who's up next? That guy. That guy right there. Why are you fighting us? Who are all of you? <laughs> you are fucking trash. Oh my god. You are knocking that guy out like he owes you money. That guy did not come here for a fight today. Come are here. Are you just gonna fucking come here. come here? You just are joining the fray. This is some this Super Smash here? Brothers. Circle to finish him. Finish him. Oh! I do again. Wow. I just went and ran into a <laughs> burning like house <laughs> development and beat up a bunch of veterans. Okay. Crime scene time. What do we got? What was that? What? What am I looking at here? A brick? Just a brick? Huh. Mortar is like dust. Is that normal in a fire? Oh, like shit. It looks like the cement barely adhered to the brick. Dude. Any wall ties either. Whoa. This thing looks like it was built on the cheap. Yo. These other boys, we're done here already? If we're paying a you know what? What? My career, let's bite the bullet and get on with it. This was a setup. This. These houses were supposed to burn down. But they didn't? No, they knew they were going to burn down, and so they built them shitty. They never built them to be lived in. They built them to be burned. That has to be what happened. They built them to be burnt? I think so. That's why the quality of the houses is so shitty. They burnt the house down to be built. No, they built they this built this whole housing development in order to burn it down for some reason. Like, I think maybe they get money from it or something like that. Because this, remember, this is the one I think that, uh, what's his name, was was part of. Fucking, uh, that shitty doctor. Yeah. And I think maybe his plan has some sort of insurance scam built into it. I see what you're saying. So let's go to the development office. And I'm going to T 
tease out my theory a little bit. See what happens here. Fire truck. Fire truck. Fire, you already crashed the fire truck. You box Biggs in. He's no. getting out. You can't box Biggs in. You gotta be kidding me. Hell yeah, Biggs. Look, Alex, you had to promise me. What? That we will at least try once per case <laughs> to drive a fire truck. I'm trying my best here. I'm I'm doing it. I'm driving this truck. I love it. Watch this. Three, two, one. I'm going at full speed right now. Brakes. That's not too bad. Yes, it is. I'm still not stopped. Keep going. Keep going. You're now in a I'm truck. Stopped. Go. All right. All right. Let's try and hop over the line. Turn on your siren. Hey, to be fair, everyone knows we're coming, so that's a good thing. That's true. We're big and red. Everyone. <laughs> You can't miss it. We're like can't Clifford. miss the big red guys. The big we're red. Like, we're like the Clifford oh, of cars. Wallace, if you, oh, come on, dude. You wanna, look at him. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to fight me. All right. I can't turn. Oh my god. All right. No, nah, dude, you're fine. Oh my god, what? You're fine. What just fell off of my you, truck? You just, you're fine. What are you talking about? Yo. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That was great. It's like too hard. It's, I can't stop. That was great. Get out of the way. You're moving now. There's great. a fire. Oh my god. Move faster. There's a fire. All of you need to move. There's a Don't fire. Don't you understand? There's a fire. We are the cops. And we're coming to arrest you. Uh, are you in the Beatles? I don't know anymore. <laughs> I can't do dialects. I can only do Indian. That's horribly you sound like you sound like Paul McCartney. All right, I'm here. All right, cool. <laughs> Rolling up in the fucking fire truck. Fraser, will you grab the blanket for a second? I gotta get Wallace. He's he's having a little bit of a freak out moment. You know what? Tell you what, we'll call it here. Okay, you're gonna we'll investigate Elysian Fields. Do you want to take Wallace out in just a moment? I'll take him. I'll take him for a little. He's a little antsy. He's a little antsy pantsy. Yeah, he'll be all right. We'll be we'll be back next time with some more investigation. See you later. Later man. Later man.